We've made progress since the report to Air is Human, what, 15 or 16 years ago, in particles of care. Fewer pressure ulcers, fewer central line infections, uh, few, uh, we're progress on medication reconciliation, but we've not made healthcare safer systemically. And we won't, we can't, until we can take a stock of the safety levels in organizations systematically and at a price we can afford. Now, a few years ago, the Institute for Healthcare Improvement, my colleagues in this organization, developed the Global Trigger Tool. It's a methodology for comprehensive assessment of the safety of a hospital. Um, it can be done. It's been done, well-published, used around the world now, but still done basically manually. What this paper is about is the automation of a comprehensive assessment of safety through the use of the electronic health record. What Fran Griffin and Dave Klassen thought of and invited me to join in on is a plea. It's a plea to take the electronic health record, which is now starting to reach its maturity, or at least in its adolescence, and look at it as a tool, a lens, through which to study and assess overall safety, at least in the hospital context. We propose that, that at least at the first step, a way to do that would be to automate the global trigger tool. That's one way to do it. But the more general idea is to use the electronic health record as a window on safety and care. It's not happening now. Most organizations don't know how to do it. Most electronic health records have not, not been configured for that. But we think that's, that's the way to go. If we don't do that, then we're trapped. We're trapped in forms of review of care that are retrospective, not real time, that are highly expensive, that involve a lots of hands-on human work without using the power of modern information technology and artificial intelligence to spot um, at least indicators that when there are safety issues. What to do next is to make the electronic health records um, fit for use for the examination overall of overall quality in systems. I hope beginning with a global trigger tool, but again, if there's a better way to do that, by all means. Uh, the resistance is, is serious. We need the electronic health record vendors to buy into that and do that kind of creative work. And even equally important, we need healthcare systems to demand it. We need hospitals and boards of trustees and leaders in hospitals for starters to say, we need to know what the overall levels are in our, in our organization. We need to do it in a way that we can afford over the long haul. Let's use the power of the electronic health record as a way to get there. Um, it's possible, not done, but possible. And we hope that investments are made now in that forward path. We ought to be safer. And we won't know we are, and we won't be able to get there without that kind of comprehensive view.